Okay, so again, this video is not structured. This topic stems from me scrolling on TikTok again, like I always do. I'm always scrolling on TikTok because I make TikTok videos. I came across this video of Aaliyah Janelle. I think that's how you pronounce her name, but she's basically a dancer here on YouTube. So here's the video right here. Now I ain't never been with a baddie. Mm, she calm, so I add her to the tally. Now, this is the topic of people and a lot of women, but people in general asking women if they are pregnant or telling a woman you look like you're pregnant. Now, if we don't know this by now, it's 2022. It's very rude. Especially if you don't know that person. Very rude to ask somebody if they are pregnant or to tell somebody. Oh, you look like you're glowing. You look like you're pregnant. Just because you put that you look like you're glowing phrase in there does not make it hit any less harder it's not a compliment maybe maybe if they really are pregnant it could be it could be but in the off chance they are not pregnant and especially if you don't know that person do not ask them that do not assume they are pregnant does that really affect your life no it doesn't it i get tired of people especially on social media. They always like to be in other people's business. And honestly, I feel like a lot of people do that on purpose. A lot of people know that it's rude to ask somebody that, but they're trying to be a smart ass. Like you're not dumb, you're not 12 years old. I mean, even a 12 year old might catch on to that. But these are grown adults. You guys are grown people. Imagine if you were a woman and you gained a little bit of weight and somebody asks you, are you pregnant? Or somebody tells you, oh, you're glowing. You look like you're pregnant. Like, no, we know where that stems from. Stop saying that. It's not your business. If people want to know, they will tell you that they're pregnant. It's not your business to ask, especially if you don't know that person. I was looking in the comment section and what really bothered me that there were so many comments about it. Like there, I do feel like there were some genuine people in there who really might not have been trying to be rude, but still, if you have to think about- If it's gonna be a rude question or not? Just don't ask it. Like it's not that serious, unless it's something you seriously need to know where it's gonna affect your life in some type of way then I understand you asking somebody that. But 99.9% .9 of the time, it's just you being nosy. The answer doesn't really matter to you. You just wanna know for your own personal reason, not even thinking about how the other person might feel on the other end of that, especially when, when it comes to women and their weight. That's very, very sensitive. And every woman knows that. A woman's weight is a very sensitive subject. When people ask you that, or people assume that, let's say 99.9% .9 of the time, it's pertaining to them looking bigger. On the off chance that person is not pregnant and they just happen to gain some weight, do not ask them that. Like, you have common sense. I mean, I wanna feel like people have common sense. Older I get, I feel like common sense is not common or it's not practiced like it should be, but I would like to think people have the common sense to realize that's a sensitive question to ask somebody. It's very, very sensitive, especially if you don't know that person, especially if you don't know that person. But people, especially on social media, they get this, they get this confidence. They pull this confidence out their ass and they just, they just like to do things that they wouldn't do in person. Because we all know as women, if we were asked this question and we were not pregnant. Or somebody assumed we were pregnant and we were not pregnant. How many of y'all would be upset? Leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know. If you happen to gain some weight and somebody asks you, Oh my God, are you pregnant? 
Oh, oh my God, you're glowing. We know what you're trying to say. That's all I'm saying. Like, we not, we not dumb. You know what that means when you asking us, are we pregnant or saying that we look like we got a glow to us. And I mean, some women do have the glow, but if you have the glow and you're pretty much, I just want to say like you're, you're small, like a lot of people are not going to assume that. They might assume like you just had some great sex or something. You know what I mean? Like it's just, we're not going to automatically go to like pregnant. Mainly like when you see somebody who used to be a little smaller and she, she was, a, she used to be a little smaller and she did gain some weight. It's usually when people start to ask that question. I saw an interview with B. Simone and she was saying the same thing. She gained some weight and people on social media was asking like, oh my God, are you pregnant? And they were, you know, saying the little glow term again. Uh, you look like you're glowing, are you pregnant? And she was like, no bitch, I'm just gaining weight. It's Chipotle, I'm not pregnant. So we know where that stems from. Like, just, just stop. Like, it's just, it's getting old now. It's 2022. Like, it's, it's getting old. Like, you can't just be walking around acting like you ain't got no common sense. Especially if somebody gets offended by it and you don't know why. And you're like, oh my God, it was just an honest question. Like, come on. Like, just use your common sense. Like, sometimes. Just, just use it. Like, just... Just, I, I, I don't understand it. And I don't understand it because I would never do something like that. Stay out of people's business. Like, just stay out of people's business. If you stay out of people's business, this world will be a lot less stressful to live in. Okay, so that's all I want to say in this video. Thanks for watching.